Hi, this is Kathy. You're going to love this video. Before you adjust your tension, remove your bobbin case. Clean out the bobbin area. Spread the tension discs and blow out any lint buildup in the discs. Setting your bobbin tension. With the thread coming off the right side of the bobbin, insert the bobbin into the bobbin case. Pull the thread up through the tension. With the bobbin case flat in your palm, pull the thread vertical out of the bobbin. The bobbin case should stand vertical without coming off of your palm. If the bobbin case comes off of your palm, your bobbin tension is too tight. To adjust your bobbin tension, locate the large screw. Using a pin or nail, loosen the screw about an eighth of a turn. Once the bobbin stands vertical, your bobbin tension is set. Setting your top tension. Loosen the tension knob so it is even with the end of the post. Thread your machine. Make sure the thread is seated all the way between the tension discs. Be sure to catch the check spring and thread guide after the spring. Get a practice piece of quilt. Pull up the bobbin thread. Start the machine and move the practice piece around. Take 20 to 30 stitches to test the tension. Good tension will look the same on both sides of the quilt and the threads will knot in the middle of the layers. If you are having loops under your quilt, tighten your top tension. Fine tune your tension on the practice piece before quilting an actual quilt. If your thread is difficult to pull through your machine, loosen your tension so the thread can be pulled smoothly through the machine. If you have very large loops under your quilt and your top thread is very loose, check to make sure that the thread is not bypassing the check spring. If the thread is in the guide, the top tension is loose and should be tightened two to three full turns. If your top thread is loose and you have loops underneath your quilt, your top tension is loose and should be tightened one to two full turns. If your bottom thread is pulling up through the top of the quilt and you have ripples on the top of your quilt, your top tension is too tight and should be loosened one to two full turns. Every thread is different and might require fine tuning before quilting. Most threads will tell you the weight and might suggest a needle size. The block rocket can use any type of thread, even metallic and glitter threads. Thanks for watching.